hello there. Uh, I forgot to record the first little bit of this. I thought I'd press the button. It was just me putting some yellow and pink um, chalk onto a blank piece of paper. Uh, I'm doing blurry Zeno plants. These um, are really, really close up to the camera. This is kind of... It's a bit of a weird shot, and I wasn't sure quite what I thought of it at first. And then the more I looked at it, the more I thought, actually, yeah, this is quite an interesting effect. I've not been quite true to the actual image. The actual image had a second line, a sort of band around, caused by the way the graphics card created the blurring technique in the outside camera. So what I've just done, I've done a kind of blurry edge to these flower heads. Um, they kind of... They look like kind of like the dried flower heads at the end of end of a year, as this sort of just going over. So, but it, I think these are them at different stages. You've got these like these little twisty, twirly little buds opening up, and and also you've got full flowers as well. And and, and there's lots of subtle colour in. There's this greenish beige colour with a little bit of purple in there, even as well. All caused by the uh, the the effect of the light in this picture that there's a star very low on on the horizon which is why the center of my picture I've got that kind of that paler I made it a little bit lighter in the center above this star there's uh, an eclipsed planet which you can't really see the planet that's entirely silhouetted but it's it's not really silhouetted it's kind of almost it's grayed out by the atmosphere on this planet the thing that's in focus in this this picture is is the, well it's the eclipse but also the commander so they've brought the focus in so that only the very closest part of this picture to you is blurred i quite like that effect it gives you that feeling that um, it's the commander's experience that we're we're seeing here they, they um there they are in their um, their botany suits um going out exploring looking at the plants there's there's good money to be made in that <laughs> quite a lot of credits you can get for exploring and finding new plants I, I gave up using chalks on the commander. I know it's a bit of a cheat. I I needed I needed him to look focused. So after a bit, I thought this isn't this isn't going to look right. So I used my watercolor pencils. Uh, and the good thing with the watercolor pencils is that um, when I'm done with them, I can uh, I can take a tiny paintbrush and 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 refine the edges. I considered doing the Eclipse Planet in my white pencil as well, but and then I thought, actually, do you know what? It's not going to show up enough, and I really wanted that effect of the sunlight piercing through this atmosphere. So I used my white acrylic paint, and, and I just thought, it doesn't matter, does it? You just, just to finish it all off, make it look like it's done then. Anyway, well, look, thank you. Thank you for listening, and um, I'll probably do another one soon.